Right, old Landy car, 1962. Uh, cracking thing, really. I uh, I really like this. First initial thoughts, it's a bit, ooh. But um, no, the closer you get and you look round it and you start it up, it runs absolutely lovely. Cracking old tub. Uh, looks very solid. Uh, I got a bit of a list here. Service 50 miles ago. It's had a new fuel tank, pump and carb. Converted back to petrol in 2020 as a gas system did not comply with the current regs. Four new tyres with less than 100 mile on. Uh, fuel pump switch under dash, mobiliser under dash. And he's happy for the new owner to contact him. Uh, so there you go. Real, uh, you know, genuine sale. And it's a, it's a cracking thing. Yeah, it runs absolutely spot on, which you'll hear in a minute. Fires straight up, no problem. Uh, I'm a bit rubbish on the Series 1, 2s, 2As and 3s. I think... Oh, um, yeah, it's got the two lights and the, obviously them lights have been aftermarket and them wings. So I'm not too sure actually, I think it's maybe a little bit of a mix and match. Um, but anyway, good solid thing, <laughs> either use it as it is, round farm, whatever, or it wants lick of paint and you're there really, that's about it. Um, good solid arches, good chassis from what I can see. Um, yeah, cracking, cracking motor, fire straight up every time. Still got all the spot welds in the uh, rear quarter and things there where they should be. Real genuine, uh, that does lock, genuine old thing. And again, like I say, very solid. Let me show you under there from what I can see. It looks, um, yeah, it looks very good. Very good. It'd be a good buy, this. Um, but like I say, give it a coat of paint. Won't take long. Easy job. And um, you're there, wants some mud flat, you know, wants a little bit of tinkering about with, doesn't it? Add a bit of this, add a bit of that, and uh, you've soon got yourself a real cracking old landy. Uh, see, all these must be different, I think, aren't they? Obviously, and lights and things. Um, but yeah, I'm really impressed with it, to be fair. I really like it. It's good everywhere, really, all over where it matters. You know, doors and things. Oh, tell, tell, tell a little bit of badness down there. I didn't, I've only just spotted that. Bit of badness on that uh, door there, just a bit of drama. I'll just check on the other one in a minute for you. Uh, but good seats. Um, it's a uh, different dash, I think. Anyway, um, but no, real nice. Real nice motor. Bit of carpet and that in the back, look. Once a headlining, if you're bothered. Uh, just that a look for you. Bit of choke under there, look. Bang, straight up, no problem. Don't know if you can hear it, but it sounds lovely, real crisp, sweet engine. I'm uh, not really impressed with it. Just put choke in a little bit and it's ticking over there, lovely. Just open this. Uh, now. Yeah, so first bit I've spotted so far under, you know, all around here and things, all very good. So I'm step down like, but no, it all looks as it should be in there. A lot of that's just surface like, but a little bit of drama down there as well. Uh, but not, nothing terrible. Oh yeah, there's a bit of a uh, So then two doors, which are nothing at all, are they? And uh, no, it's all right. Go over a bit of paint, give it a bit of TLC, a bit of weekend work, as granddad would say, and you're there. You've got, I mean, you've got a cracking car to start with. Um, but uh, no, a very easy uh, project. Um, so there you go, yeah, ticking over there nice and quietly, you can hardly hear it run. Lovely motor. Sounds really nice. No, I'm very impressed with it. Uh, three former keepers. I think that was about it. There's a few bits just what have been done here on my list. Um, but three former keepers, I think maybe a few other little bits and pieces, but nothing important. I don't think I'll just check on the uh, Two seconds. Oh, MOT, that was it. 
Yeah, three former keepers here and a uh, test certificate. Um, yeah, just the tyres worn. So obviously got four new tyres on it. Other than that, straight pass, which is good. So there you are on that one.